here to advise you on the proper autumn behavior. Rule one, shorts are no longer acceptable outerwear. Cover up those knees, people. I don't want to see them. I hate knees. Today is Tuesday, October 15th. You may stand for the pledge to the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Allegedly. Now for your school news. Julia Childs Emerson will be making BLTs for lunch today. You can have an option for a regular sriracha maple. You can have you have the option for regular or sriracha maple bacon. You also get chips and a drink. Autumn rule number two: always eat lunch, even if it's made of letters. Do you want to spotlight your village business on the morning show? Please reach out to Lighthouse Broadcasting. We'll produce a wonderful piece of cinema for you. Our current cost is three hundred Harbor dollars. Teachers, please send all announcements for the morning show to Mr. Lesky. Please note, no old theme songs are harmed in the making of this morning show. It's October, people. The Halloween dance is coming up. Forms have been handed out in homes already. The dance will be on Friday, October 25th from 5 to 7 p.m. Permission slips are due Tuesday, October 22nd. No exceptions, except for me. <laughs> <laughs> put that in the, put that in the, the yes. after. Yes. Autumn rule number three. Look at the iPad and say your lines, but don't you smile. I'm talking to you, Riley. Don't you dare smile. The consequences will be dire. Now it's time for your weather report. Today will be cloudy with a 5% chance of rain. Temperatures will be chilly today with a high of 56 degrees and a low of 40. Please wear your official morning show fall walking jackets, courtesy of Ahuba's Fine Outerwear Boutique, an official partner of the morning show. Now here's your joke of the day, brought to you by Fontu for Two, the special guest, Mr. Hargis. Good job. Stay tuned and good job. How do trees get get on the internet? How? How? They they log in. <laughs> <laughs> and cut. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Fondue for Two, and I have my guest, the my my special big guest, Mr. Hargis. Hi, uh, thanks for having me on the show, Ty. Since day one of uh, Fondue for Two, I wanted on. I wanted on the show. I guess you had to wait till you're in high school and you had me in class, right? Yes. All right. But thank you for being patient, which is something that all of you need to be instead of coming in the bathroom and telling me, when can I be on fondue for two? Leave the man alone. Yeah, so, um, anyway. Okay. Would you like some cheese? I'm, I'm a big cheese fan. Yummy. The best. Fun. Yay. How about you? You gonna try some of this cheese, too? Yeah, of course. Okay. It's very gooey and bubbly. Yeah, and also hot. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna put this. Okay. Um, you are an English teacher, a history teacher. What is your favorite subject to teach in your class? Uh, definitely literature, definitely English literature. Okay, okay. I like uh, telling stories and breaking down stories. Would what, you write a story? Would I write a story? Um, I think I tried to when I was younger. That was like what I wanted to do with my life, but then it's sort of like being like an athlete, like a basketball player. Okay. Like there's only so many that can be successful and have a job doing that. So being a professional writer wasn't in the cards. Mm -hmm. So those who can't do, teach. <laughs> what is your English class reading? I heard they're reading a book about an emo boy whose father's dead. Dude, you, you just said you're in my class. I know, but still. Oh, we're. we're 
brick fight. Yeah, there's a wall here. We don't know each other. Uh, yeah, we're reading Hamlet, which is a Shakespeare play, and yeah, he's pretty pretty emo. He wears black, black, and he mopes around, and uh, uh, he's just not a happy camper. I thought it was something that uh, my my teenage students could connect with. You, you want them to connect with a boy who's emo. His father died. His mother married his, his um his uncle. He roasted his uncle for his looks and said that his father is more prettier than than, than his uh, uncle. Yes, I think it's a great uh, play for kids to read or for teenagers to read because you know a lot of pe teenagers go through those those feels and uh, they can kind of relate. But we don't go out and kill our uncles. True, but our uncles don't go out and kill our fathers. In most scenarios. Yeah. You have four kids? Two kids? Two 18 kids. kids? Two. I got two children. Oh, of my 20. Own. I got 20 two. kids. Okay. Oh, zero. The two big zero. oh, zero. 2002 two kids. Yeah. What's it like being a dad? Oh, it's super fun at times. Um, uh, I'd like to segue from talking about fathers being killed to me being a father. That's a good segue. Uh, it's okay, it's fun. Would you swap bodies with your child? No. No, why not? No, Freaky no. Friday? Why not? Freaky Friday? Starring Lindsay Lo Lo Lohan, guys. Not forget. Nah, Haley Mills. Old school. Uh, that shit really shows you how old I am. The original. And, yes, the, you know, there was an yes. Original. I, I've uh, would that. I switch bodies for my kids? Maybe for like a minute or like a day or something, but not for like my whole life. Like, I'm content with who I am. Mm hmm. But like maybe when I get close to death, I'd swap. So then, no, then my child will be close to death. I don't want that. <laughs> Can we swap bodies when I get close to death? Your village is, what's it called? It's based <laughs> off a C. It, it it's a village. Yes. Uh, it's based it, off a C thing. It's got a name. We do things. I'm about, asking you for the name, dude. Village isn't my forte. Like I put every all my heart into teaching Monday through Thursday. Village, um, I put. 78% of my heart into, and I love it. I just forgot the name of my village right now. <laughs> Boardwalk Empire. Boardwalk Empire. Um, what yes, do you I'm like? the Boardwalk Empire with Mr. Kennedy. Do you Kennedy. like that village? Uh, actually, I really do. Okay. Yeah, we do cool stuff in there. The kids are cool. Mr. Kennedy's cool. My second to last question Ooh, is... Penultimate. You know, that's called penultimate. Is there a specific book or movie or show based off a book or news article or anything in the world you want to show your class? Um, we'll watch one of the versions of Hamlet when we're done reading Hamlet. Ethan Hawke. We'll watch the Ethan Hawke version. I think that Ethan one's pretty, pretty cool. Ethan Hawke. Uh, yeah, it's a good version. I think you already watched it and ruined the book for yourself as we or the play as we read it. I did. Um, yeah, I think sometimes uh, that th uh, showing the video, showing the movie version of a book you read, um, isn't a super useful uh, learning tool. It's more like, hey, here's a reward for for getting done the book. Here you go, let's watch this movie. You know, I'm just more about making you learn all the to time. To all my people in that class that have, I know who dies. I know who lives. If you were in the school, what would be different? If I ran the school, what would be different? Um, I mean, I like the way things are going. Um, I, Nothing I can't... in particular? No block see... sites on iPads? No, we're not blocking those sites on iPads. And, and yeah, man, um, I think everything is running really well, and I wouldn't change a single thing. Uh, my bosses do a great job. Yes. Do you want to do a special shout out to anyone watching? Uh, let, oh, let's shout out. Uh, all Not my, the cameraman. All my, all the kids Lady. in my classes. Izzy over there no. does, does a good job. Um, let me give a shout out, Miss Levin. I can't, I couldn't do it without Miss Levin. She's, she's my main, my main person. You love Miss Levin on the show. Miss Levin is amazing. Um, who else want to shout out? Um, That's our time, <laughs> folks. Thank you so much for joining us on Fondue Four Two, and thank you, Mr. Hargis, for joining me. You've been waiting so long yeah, for man, this Yeah, man, I appreciate this. It. Good time. Good time. Yes. All right. So next time, you. I'm taking over. Do you want some more cheese? Eh, I'm done with the cheese. Why not? No. It's, 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 no. It's lukewarm. It's lukewarm. It's cold. Take the cheese. It's, it's no Take longer it. bubbling. It's cool. Is it as a going away gift? Okay. So, yeah. Thanks. All right. Good. Thank you. I put poison in the cheese. I put poison in the cheese. 
From all of us at the Harbor School Morning Show, have a tentacular Tuesday. Please like and subscribe. Peace out. Yes. Oh, yeah. Autumn rule number three. <laughs> <laughs>